Hi, I'm Elliot, and today I present to you the Slim Cutter G2, Ruby's manual cutter for large format tiles. And the length of the longer guides allows us to cut 120 centimeter formats without actually putting any of the guides together. The Slim Cutter G2 comes included with two guides of 155 centimeters and a third guide of 65 centimeters, giving you a maximum cutting length of 360 centimeters if you include the distance you need for the cutting cart to enter and leave the tile. However, you can make the maximum distance as long as you want it to be by adding more guides because you can put together as many as you want to. Also comes with a separator, the scoring cart, the Allen wrench to help you put everything together and take it apart easily, three high quality rubber suction cups to hold the whole system firmly in place, and two measuring guides so you know exactly where you're going to be marking in relation to the aluminum guides. The guides have an easy to use union system that holds the system rigidly in place and allows for the cart to pass smoothly in between guides, allowing for a consistent marking from one end of the tile all the way to the other. The measuring guide is especially useful when we're preparing to cut because it tells us exactly where we are going to be marking the piece. The scoring cart comes equipped with a small spring inside that allows you to leave the cart resting on the guides and the tile without running the risk of accidentally scratching the tile because the actual scoring wheel only makes contact with the tile when you press down. Another benefit of this spring system is that it allows you to regulate the pressure when you're scoring according to the material that you're cutting. And now that we're going to mark the piece, I want to pay a special attention to the Ruby Extreme 22 millimeter scoring wheel that comes included with the Slim Cutter G2. Now that we're going to separate the tile, I want to take a special look at the breaker. The breaker has these two points that are adjustable that apply pressure on top of the tile, and you can move them either closer together or further apart. When they're further apart, they apply greater leverage when you're breaking. And if you're taking a very small part of the tile off, you can push them closer together so that your minimum breaking width is reduced. Now, if you're separating a tile from three to six millimeters in width, you only need to use this function, the plier function, on the separator. However, if you're going to separate a tile that is six to 10 millimeters in width, you can use this screw to apply a greater force of separation. And that's our video on the Slim Cutter G2. Thank you for watching, and if you have any comments or questions, you can find us on our 
social media, or on our website, ruby.com. And we'll see you at the next video.